Say hello to the taper. It looks like a large pig, but it's really more closely related to rhinos. Like a rhino, each toe on the taper's foot has its own separate hoof. Besides their special toes, tapers have a special nose. Their nose and their top lip are combined into a flexible snout. The taper can stretch its nose way out and wiggle it back and forth. What do you think the taper uses that special snout for? This is Rachel. She has an amazing snout. It's not as long as an elephant's trunk, but it's just as handy. Watch how she uses her nose to eat these leaves. Tapers live in forests, munching leaves from bushes and eating fruit that has fallen from trees. They can stand in one place, sniff around, then use their nose to move the food into their mouth. Rachel is a Baird Taper from Mexico and Central America. She lives at the zoo with some capybara. Other kinds of tapers live in South America, and the Malayan taper lives in the rainforests of Asia. This Malayan taper is with her baby. A baby taper is called a calf. <laughs> Some people say a taper calf looks like a walking watermelon. Those markings help the calf blend in with the shadows in the forest, making it harder for predators like big cats to find it. What makes a good home for a taper? A place to take shelter and a place to swim. Tapers like to spend a lot of time in the water. Even youngsters can swim when they're just a few days old. Of course, it takes some practice to get good at it. From their toes to their nose, on land or in water, tapers are really cool.